Michael Dragoni has six years of experience in education. He's a K-5 visual arts teacher in the Booter Elementary School in Rittner School District. Michael's journey to teaching had a couple of side trips. He was a police officer and a wedding photographer. He left college to pursue career as a photographer after a college professor validated his photography talent. Michael believes this professor changed his life. After a few years in the field of photography, he went back to school to pursue a degree in art and had a second defining moment. While taking a graphic design class, he found that he really had an aptitude for understanding technology and working with young people who struggled with it. Michael's professor told him that while he wasn't gifted in graphic design, he really was gifted in teaching students. This professor, professor told him that he needed to be in the classroom. He changed his major to art education and now helps students discover their talents and make sure that he validates their success. I tried a couple other careers before I came to teaching and nowhere else have I met people so quietly noble in giving of themselves and dedicated to improving the lives of others. It's the most rewarding thing in the world is showing a kid that they can do things that they didn't know that they could. But I love technology. Um, I love the things that a lot of my students enjoy, um, video games, and so you know I bring the things that I like into the classroom. If it would bore me, then it's probably gonna bore them too, and so we don't do those things. I would like to think that I've gotten people to rethink what an art teacher is, and if an art teacher isn't what you thought it was, then what other teachers could be different. Um, in my room, we do a lot of things that aren't art. We tie them to visual arts, but we do a lot of social studies. We do history, we do language arts. Um, we take things like Shakespeare and study plays and then make stop motion animations of them. One of the great things about my class is that it's one of the few places where it's okay to be wrong. Um, I tell my students that the best learning doesn't happen in our successes, but in our failures. And my room's a place to experiment and to fail, and that'd be okay. If you're not willing to risk being wrong, you'll never be creative. The value of a life could be measured by the impact it has on other lives. And I can think of no other job in which you impact more lives than as a teacher. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Michael Dragoni.